Today we're going to take a real brief look at the Texas TCU game on a day that was absolutely legendary in college basketball. Today we're going to look at one play that could have cost them much more than it ultimately end up did, and why it was such a silly decision in the moment. Alright, the first thing to establish is at this point TCU is on a little bit of a comeback, and so Texas is, the, ele the elements are getting more excited, the fans, the crowd is getting more into it, everyone is getting more excited, the emotions are running high. In situations like this, it's not enough that people talk about how players are able to stay calm or how very high level players, NBA elite athletes, college elite athletes, are able to stay calm when the stakes are crazy high. Frankly, you have thousands of people yelling at you from the stones. There are 10 players on a court. This is a stressful situation. Okay, so first off, we can see the TCU has decreased the lead from, it was like 10 at some point, down to two. It's a two point game and they get this steal right here. What happens, TCU is looking to push in transition. They did a solid job of this, this game. And there was a foul at the rim. Okay, so see what happens to the foul at the rim. Frankly, probably a good contest, he goes up. And what happens, this player right here, reaches up and just hits the ball right there. Hey, watch number five. Comes up here, has nothing to do with the play, the ball is bouncing around there, he just touches, touches the ball. What is the impact of this? The What actually got called in this, and I think this is the right call, is goaltending got called here, and frankly, maybe the rules should be revised, but regardless, number five, this is simply a fr frustration thing. You're going up there to hit the ball simply because you don't want the ball up there and you want to smack it, doesn't even smack it hard, just hits it. What's the purpose of hitting it? That was not going to go in. All that does is that it gives TCU another two points and gives them the opportunity to take the lead. He realizes right away he made a mistake. You can see him kind of clench up, but that's just an example of how often these elite athletes are able to stay composed, but every once in a while they do make mistakes and slip up, and this could have cost Texas more than it did ultimately in the game. If you enjoyed this, feel free to like and subscribe. Have a great rest of your day.